सो है गाइज वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल सो या दिस इज हाउ माई प्रिपरेशन आर गोइंग टूडे आई वॉज डूइंग लॉट ऑफ फार्मोकोलॉजी बिकॉज आई हैव एंड टच दिस बुक फ्रॉम द बिगिनिंग जस्ट फ्रॉम द बिगिनिंग ऑफ द ईयर आई हैव कम्प्लीटली रिलाइड ऑन द पेपर जी आर जी सर्च नोट्स एंड दे आर क्वाइट गोल्ड बट यू जस्ट हैव टू कम्प्लीट द बुक फॉर योर ओन सेटिस्फैक्शन सो दैट यू डोंट मिस एनी क्वेश्चन इन द एग्जाम्स एंड this is the book we actually use for our previous year questions in this particular book for our university exams so i am doing now autonomic pharmacology i have gone through the entire notes i have gone through kdt i have done it although i am reading some parts of kdt i am forgetting the other ones because you know that's a gold standard book and so you forget things but the notes are quite uh, okay and they are quite lengthy as well so the notes of grg sir especially for autonomic pharmacology is quite good and so you can complete the entire chapter uh, in fact i never felt that i should read the book in the last three exams or the last three semester exams that we had in our college so i think that this won't be a problem the extra questions which we get like i was going through one of them uh, the pre anesthetic they mention the objectives of the pre anesthetic medication so this particular one is not so much given notes so i have to go through the previous previous year questions like it is given here the point wise it is given quite okay and very good like if you can remember all these points you can easily score like if, if the entire question is of 10 marks you can easily score 8 or 9 if you can write everything so pharmacology i am planning to complete it within tomorrow let's see what happens i have completed a huge chunk of my notes uh the pyqs are left although i have gone through the pyqs at least 80% of them during my semesters but still i am trying to complete the entire one and kdt let's see how much i can do till tomorrow i have done the main main chapters what i am left with and what i think i will do bef just before the exams are the least important chapters like uh, vitamins minerals i don't think that much questions will come from that side and since we have the calcium chapter in the enzymes i think vitamin d is a uh, good question for the exams and the other rest of the other vitamin c a this is not a biochemistry exam so i don't think that this will actually come so i just have to focus on those parts that have actually come in the exam like uh, here are some miscellaneous there is a miscellaneous chapter in this book i will show you in this particular part and you can see that one question has been repeated many time that is a dysferioxamine in patients of thalassemia or iron overload so that is one question that has been see here also two times they have repeated the same question so i think i will go through this as many times as i can and this anti snake venom is also important so let's see chelating agents i have read the chapter so i will just revise it and revise it once more again just for the exams these tetanus toxoids and all i have covered it in microbiology so i think that i will be able to write something the doses and all i will have to focus on this part and i will combine it with microbiology so can i i can write the same question in both the papers if asked so that's it for today